Hi, everybody. Happy Monday. This is a pick a card reading for today, Monday, September 12th. You pick a card, it's your main energy, but I pull them all together. And if you're born today on the 12th, I'll do your reading next. All right. Card number one is the Seven of Pentacles. Seven of Pentacles. Let's put it this way. You're on the right path. There's something you need to reassess, okay? What are your passions and your goals? Fears. This could be some decisions that you have to make, but there is a fear. I do feel that there's been interference or there's been people throwing wrenches in your path here, especially where you've been investing, all right? where, where What are you investing in? Uh, for some of you, this is... Be careful that you are not um, overspending money in something. Like, let's put it this way. You're buying Starbucks every day. Add that up how much it costs, okay? So there is a sense of streamlining, too. Money should be coming in. You're on the right path is what I'm picking up. You head in the right direction. You are growing your finances. You are growing. Um, I want to say there is something that is growing in your life, too. It's not just always finances. It's something of value. You're doing well. But there is something here. It's either a passion that you need to invest in. There's a new, renewed passion Find it. Break free of restriction. Where have you been restricted or is the environment around you or a person holding you back? You may have to reassess your inner circle, who you are involved with. It's almost like, you know, guilty by association or these are people who are not helping you progress. There's a strong energy here with this. All right. Card number two, five of wands. Ooh, I feel there's some flirtatious energy here. You may realize that or not someone may be fighting for your attention. You yourself may be impatient. You're wanting something to move along. You are moving through. Yes, you are. You, um, It's coming through things. You know, there's a little bit of a challenge. It's like trying to push through. But you will. These are, this is a day of you're trying to like multitask, multitask, get things done. But you know, patience is key. You're going to make these changes, adjustments. And you're ready and firm on where you want to push ahead. Your creative ideas and work is going to be worth it. I think it's going to pay off. If there's any competitive energy around you, you will win the competition some way, some form or another. Sometimes this is challenging our own selves. Patience is required, though. Card number three. Page of Pentacles. This could be some kind of offer or proposition, and I feel you may walk away from it or change your mind. This could be a job offer. This could be some news that's coming in, too. Be careful of a child around you who's making you feel guilty. Don't do things out of guilt. You will find some endings and finally put a close to something as well. Seven of Pentacles, Five of Wands, and the Page of Pentacles. Some of us here are paying attention to the mystical energy around you. This is like signs, omens, maybe had a dream. We're working on something here trying to figure something out. We may come to a point where we're going to have to make some decisions. Maybe we've been putting them off. 
It's like we come to a crossroads or impasse or indecision as well. Communication is important. You may hear from somebody you haven't talked to in a long time. There's a lot of like up and down and scattered energy around today. Uh, the past is showing up. This is either revisiting, rehashing a place or a person. There's an Aquarius energy coming through. It's almost like we've been a little bit too complacent with some things. So it's time to kind of um, step out of our comfort zone or deal with a situation and keep it moving forward. All right, so that is the reading for today, Monday, September 12th. Have a fabulous Monday. Happy birthday if you're born today, September 12th. This is your solar, your theme. That's your wish card. And your theme is a major arcana of the magician. Beautiful one to have. You're strongly at a new beginning. A lot of things you wish, desire, and hope is there before you. Uh, the magician is as above, so below. You can manifest a lot. You got the magic touch, okay? There is a downside to this. I do feel be careful of tricky people around you too. Yes, you have the skills. Yes, you have the um, ability. Yes, you have the creativity because your self-worth is um, coming up here. What you value about yourself as well. Your perception, if you think positive and accept change and change the way you view some things, it's going to help. Your perception will change. Creating a strong balance this year. Some of you may be dealing with um, court, legal issues. Some of you will be traveling. Some of you will be graduating. You have a world of possibilities here. World events may create some kind of change for you. Soulmate is coming in. Deep-rooted communications. I do feel um, also you may be um, going into a partnership in personal life and in work. But your perceptions are definitely transforming. If you see butterflies around during the year, especially if they're around at a point in time, or more than one, that is going to be the time of your perceptions changing and also transition. Your wish for your solar year is another major arcana of the chariot. One, I'm going to say that there can be a man coming into play with this wish. This person is somehow in authority or um, is skilled somehow. A, a truth may be uh, coming out. I see overall happiness and victory. So this wish should come to fruition. Important numbers for your solar year. 21. 2. 7. 1. 11. A hundred and eleven. I hope you have a wonderful birthday and a blessed solar year ahead and beyond. Everyone else, a wonderful Monday and bye for now.